Energy tensions may increase as Russia cutting Nord Stream 1 gas to 20%. Russia's Gazprom said on Monday it was halting another turbine in the Nord Stream 1 pipeline to Germany and that flows of gas would fall to the equivalent of just one-fifth of normal capacity. The new blow to supply comes at a moment of high tension as Russia and the West exchange economic blows in response to Moscow's invasion of Ukraine. The European Union has accused Russia of resorting to energy blackmail, while the Kremlin says the gas disruption has been caused by maintenance issues and the effect of Western sanctions. Gazprom said it was halting the operation of another Siemens gas turbine at Nord Stream 1's Potovaya Compressor Station in accordance with the instructions of the relevant watchdog, taking into account the technical condition of the engine. Throughput from 4 a.m. GMT on Wednesday would therefore fall to 33 million cubic meters per day. That is just half of the current flows, already at just 40% of normal capacity. Politicians in Europe have repeatedly warned that Russia could cut off gas flows this winter, a step that would thrust Germany into recession and lead to soaring prices for consumers already grappling with higher prices for food and energy. Germany was forced last week to bail out Uniper, its biggest company importing gas from Russia. President Vladimir Putin warned the West this month that continued sanctions risked triggering catastrophic energy price rises for consumers around the world. Putin foreshadowed the latest cut in comments on the Nord Stream 1 compressor last week when he said there are two functioning machines there. They pump 60 million cubic meters per day. If one is not returned, there won't be one, which is 30 million cubic meters. Thank you for listening and see you in the next videos.